Okay, stop scrolling. What happens when you throw a classroom robot, a nerdy little desktop bot, and a robot dog with serious attitude into one room? Chaos, but also magic. Today, it's Dash vs. Ricci Mini vs. Sirius in the first ever AI robot showdown. And I promise you, you've never seen anything like this. Let's go! First up, Dash. Tiny, blue, bouncy, and smarter than your average 6th grader. Dash was built to teach kids to code, but don't call him a kid's toy. This guy can dance, react to sound, change lights, and even clap back when you press his head. If you've got a curious kid, or you are a curious kid at heart, Dash gets it. Now, Richie Mini, straight out of Hugging Face. Yeah, that Hugging Face. He's like if Wally learned Python and moved into your office. With twitchy antennae, a head that rotates like it's judging your life choices, and the ability to run code straight from your laptop, Richie Mini is a full-on desktop sidekick. You don't even need the robot to start. Test your code in a simulator first, then bring it to life later. And then, there's Sirius. A robot dog? Sure, but this thing? It's like a cyberpunk puppy with personality. It can jump, dance, bark, stare into your soul, and even, yeah, pretend to pee. It's packed with sensors, emotion, and moves smoother than my dance floor game on a Friday night. Alright, who actually listens? We gave them each simple commands. Dash, say hello. Boom. He lights up and does a spin. Reachy, wave. His antennae wiggle and he nods like, Sup, human. Serious, are you bored? He stomps his little robot paws and spins like he's about to drop an album. Okay, they're all responsive. But serious, that eye contact? That's the stuff of emotional damage. So, who's got brains? Dash ran a dance sequence we built in the Wonder app. Took two minutes. Clean. Precise. Adorable. Reachy Mini locked onto my face and tracked my head like a mini security drone. Zero internet. All local smarts. Serious? We taught him ballet mode and the little guy struck a pose like a star ballerina at a robot recital. Oh, and he barked when I sneezed. No clue if that was on purpose. Time to test their moves. We built a mini obstacle course. Cones, blocks, ramps, the usual chaos. Dash rolled in strong, hit a cone, apologized with flashing lights. Ricci got lost. He was spinning like he was buffering in real life. Sirius hopped over the ramp, spun in the air, and bowed at the finish line. I'm not saying he showed off, I'm just saying if he had sunglasses, he'd wear them indoors. Dash is all about the apps. Blockly, Wonder, Path, just drag and drop. Even my grandma could figure it out. Ricci Mini? Python, baby! And coming soon, Scratch and JavaScript, the whole squad. Serious? App? Check. Game controller? Check. VR headset to see what Sirius sees? Check. It's like having a dog, a drone, and a gaming console in one. Now here's the twist. There's no single winner, because here's the truth. Dash is the teacher. For families, classrooms, and first-timers, it's perfect. Ricci Mini is the builder. If you like to code, hack, and push limits, this one's for you. Serious? He's the showstopper. If you want something alive, unpredictable, and packed with attitude, Sirius brings the drama. So you tell me, who wins the crown? The whiz kid, the brainy bug bot, or the dramatic robot dog? Hit the comments, let's argue. And if you want to see these three robots do something completely ridiculous, like cook eggs, build a Lego city, or go camping in the living room, smash that like button and subscribe Technology X AI. This is just the beginning. Catch you in the next one.